constantly making my health work. You know, I've had a couple of heart attacks, a few strokes, tuberculosis, PCP pneumonia, where I didn't even have a immune system at all. But it was people like Mr. Cosgrove to pick me up and put me back together. My mom named me Jonathan Bobo, but everybody says Johnny Bobo. But having a last name of B-O-B-O, -O, it's almost like I don't have a first name. So everybody just say, hey Bobo, what's going on? I never wanted to love anybody to death. So all I did was get high. Because for one reason, it made me impotent. It made me comfortable when I was sleeping on a park bench or in the bushes. When I was in uh, San Antonio, Texas. My son came and showed love to me, encouraged me, and then he said, come on back home to Cleveland. I came back to Cleveland. When I was about 20 years into the diagnosis of HIV, I was always candid about my virus. My friends said, man, we don't want to hear that. Stop living in the past. Get busy living instead of get busy dying. And that was one of the motivating factors that I said, well, hell, I ain't gonna die like no sucker. So I said, I got to tighten up. And that's what I've been trying to do. They helped me with a rent voucher. I didn't have any money. I didn't have any job. She knew I was in treatment trying to better myself. They gave me the money to get my apartment. Catholic Charities connect to a lot of resources. As I started overcoming my drug addiction and she extended her helping hand, she referred me to Ohio Means Jobs. And Ohio Means Jobs sent me to National Black Caucus for Seniors. And the National Black Caucus for Seniors referred me to Fred Ward, who has Kanemo Lighthouse. They help guys coming out of prison to get on their feet. Ohio is one of many states that the recidivism rate is extremely high. Eight out of 10 people incarcerated been there before. So that's a staggering statistic. It's just like a revolving door. Maybe I can help people from going back. What's that song? I get by with a little help from my friends and they certainly become my friends. Bishop Cosgrove, uh, Kanemu. It's like a labor of love for me now. I see it as a career for me. Everybody that's misenfranchised has this one beacon of light, Bishop Cosgrove. From 2100 to the women's shelter, the mental health apartments, they all gravitate down here. It's a lifesaver. Bishop Cosgrove is saving a lot of people's lives.